A Calgary family is still reeling after their toddler almost died at a Saskatchewan rest stop last week. One minute she was playing, the next she nearly drowned. Now that they are back home safe and sound, they want to make sure no one else is ever put in that same kind of danger. Jamie Marocker explains. We got a cat. Oh, you're the caller, so you don't even get a card, right? We have a fish. Game time in the Pickersgill home now yeah. means a little bit more. The Calgary family cherishing every second together, yeah. relieved their 21-month-old daughter, Natea, oh. is still with them. Okay, put it down. <laughs> On Thursday, they were road tripping to Regina when they pulled into this rest stop near Maple Creek. After lunch, sisters Soraya, Elena, and Natea started to play on top of a septic tank lid, pretending it was a stage. All three of them were there and laughing, and my older two girls, they stepped off of it. And... <laughs> And my baby fell in, and I was right there, and I tried to grab her. Natea fell two and a half meters into the sewage. Trevor, hearing his wife's screams, ran over. Jumped in about waist high in sewage water, and then she was going through another tunnel. And uh, I just got, I just got to reach her foot, and her leg, in time. It's like a couple of seconds later, she probably would have been gone. With both of them stuck inside the tank, workers from the information center raced to help, calling 911. She looked at me with these big bug eyes and she was pale white. And then hoisting the pair out with a rope. When I was holding her, all she was like saying to me is, Nan night, mom, Nan night. And I was like, no, Nan night. With the potential for concussion, broken bones, and bacterial infection, Natea and her father were rushed to hospital. The government of Saskatchewan saying this never should have happened. We don't have any idea whether it was uh, rusted or worn or broken or tampered with or vandalized. The septic tank lid has been properly secured and an investigation is underway. The province ordering an assessment of all 52 of its tanks across Saskatchewan. Go! And thanks to Dad's quick thinking, back at home, you'd never know what little Natea has been through, walking away with just cuts and bruises. He's a hero. Uh -huh. He saved our family. And we're still whole. Jamie Marocker, CTV News, Calgary.